All right, guys, what's going on? Jumping back here, I figure, you know, that they're probably going to release Berlin with the um, end of the battle pass here. So I figured a lot of people are probably going to want to know how are the tanks? And I've already made an Imcha video. I highly recommend the Imcha. And I just got the Panther um, A here, the premium Panther. And so I figured, guys, I'd do a quick video. I'd play in it. This is my first time playing in this thing. So I'll just give my raw thoughts on it. I do know that it does have a faster turret rotation speed than the base Panther G, and it's certainly a better tank than just the, the Panzer IV um, starting tank. So if you are looking to branch out from that um, and you want a better tank initially, then I'm sure this is what you're going to want. Um, but it does suffer from what a lot of the tanks suffer from um, in the Berlin campaign, and that is very low speed going backwards. So just keep that in mind. There's a T-34 there. We should be able to just blast it. And there it goes. Um, but you are in a Panther, and you're going to be able to take on basically any of the T-34s. You're going to be able to take on a Sherman. Um, you are the big boy on the block when you're in a Panther like this. Um, the downside is that you're playing Germany in Berlin, and Germany in Berlin kind of sucks. Let's be real. But what doesn't suck is this tank. This tank is amazing. I don't really know. All right, he's going to just back off there. You don't have as good of infantry killing power, I believe, as a T-34 would. But you don't really need it, to be honest with you guys. You're kind of just fine alone. This guy is shooting at me, but can he hit me? That's the question. I don't think he can. But you got to be really careful because you do only have... You have very low um, and very slow backup time. You know, reverse speed. So you can get, you can get trapped by explosive packs very very easily so go ahead and watch out with that stuff because you can't just turn around when you're on these big streets and stuff i mean there's no just backing up the whole way um you got to make sure you know you can't just turn around and be like all right i'm just gonna reverse like no 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 that's gonna get you killed so just uh just be aware of that when you go down these long streets i'm gonna kind of start reversing backwards oh there's a guy right there go ahead and get that guy down oh and we just got fucking we just got bitch slapped by that t-3485 i don't think we're gonna survive this one here oh the whole thing is down oh the whole the whole turret drives down all right i'm gonna get out there's no way that's kind of the way it goes a lot of the time i mean it's hard to deal with it i'm gonna repair i might be able to pull some stuff off here in the mighty panther just shot me who's shooting at me is it you you I don't think I'm going to get it. Got that guy. There's the other one. I'm going to wiggle my turret a little bit. Make it harder for him to get a shot through the turret. Oh, I got him. Nice. I don't think I got the gunner. Oh, I did get the gunner. They're going to switch seats pretty quick. Come on, come on. Reload, reload. Put another one in. We got them both. Nice. That is what we like to see. I'm going to keep reversing. We now have three tank kills under our belt. And we're going to try to get ourselves the hell out of here away from these ruskies uh, you got an explosive pack oh that's not good all right we're okay though see this is why the backup speed really sucks on this thing our breach is kind of damaged i'm glad it didn't break oh that might kill us i think that's gonna kill us nope you can see how hard it is to just reverse it's just so damn slow and if people know what they're doing there is not a lot you can do against against them he's wiggling i don't know what he's doing I think there's there's something behind me I can't really see. Uh oh, oh, it's a frag. What are you doing, mate? The, the frag is, feels nothing. The panther feels nothing against your tiny fragmentation grenade. Although the MG34s are a lot better here, I do like the MG34s. I don't know where I can back up. I can't really turn around. I guess I'm just gonna kind of stay here and mow them down. Woo! Big old cannon. The HE, I feel, is not as effective as the, as the 85's HE, but it's still very powerful and still will pretty much wreck a lot of enemies. Like, you know, if you blast somebody, they're gonna die. Like, but they are taking this objective. How are they taking this point with so much... with me holding back so many enemies here? This is the problem with playing Germany. The Russians just have such better infantry combat, and that's how you, that's how you win the game, you know? is infantry but we can maybe make something work here ah, they got us it's really hard to stop that 
Uh, but honestly, just it feels good. Uh, the tank feels good. Uh, it rotates quickly. I mean, it's an incredibly powerful tank. We already know that. Let's show off the MP40-1 a little bit here. I'm not a huge fan of this thing, but you got to buy it in the bundle with the PPD, and the PPD is great. It's a good pickup. Um, but just like the Imcha guys, the Panther is a great tank to pick up if you just want to grind the campaigns really quickly because the premium does give you double XP, and then it's a tank which already gets you a lot, a lot, a lot of XP. So overall, you're going to be getting a lot of XP just using that tank. We'll see how much I get after this game, but I imagine it's going to be a solid amount. And I do like the MP40-1. The thing I don't like about it is that it doesn't automatically switch fire like the 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 stick mags you know it doesn't automatically switch to the other side of the gun the way that i kind of want it to because it has like two magazines right that's the whole thing is it's got like the double mag kind of thing but once you fired off the first 32 bullets it doesn't automatically switch you have to like manually stop firing and then switch it which can just be very annoying um, in my opinion let's go with an infantry squad here i guess we'll go with an infantry squad we'll get back in the panther after this keep playing around in it um this will be the last objective that you can really use a panther effectively because after this they'll be able to get into the objective um and inside the reichstag itself without really having any problems against tanks so we'll be kind of on our own there but this last objective you can park a tank right up at the top and kind of slow them down getting into the point which is what we'll do here if we're able to hold it just getting kind of shredded there. Why are my infantry's all the way back here? That's one of the problems that you guys are probably going to see with Berlin, assuming it releases. Um, you know, it sometimes your AI just have really, really bad pathing. They like to just go in really stupid areas. I'm not sure if I like this car 98. I think one of the things I don't like about this car 98 is that it's like this, this cool and different car 98 that's like, you know, Germany made because it was cheaper to make and they were so press for resources but the thing that's silly about it is that they immediately add the other car 98 like the standard car 98 that guy with the dp is killing everybody right now there we go got him missing so many shots there all right oh i was gonna drop down and then i didn't and then i died well oh that was a beautiful throw my friend all right fair enough dude looks like we already have our two tanks so that's not going to do anything um let's go ahead and get a rally point down we can spawn on the objective and then maybe just get a rally down in some cheeky spot can't build it over here we'll build it up in this area probably in the big hallway back here that's where i kind of like to build rally points for this objective it's a pretty solid place just up here the russians do like coming through that window right there so just be aware of that guys but if you build a rally back here um, it's pretty hard for the Russians to get to it. And you're normally going to be able to do quite a bit of damage before they are able to stop you. It looks like I'm kind of dominating my team. And I imagine there's probably a lot of bots um, in the game. It looks like we have at least three bots on our team from those three players that left. But that's just kind of how it goes. I mean, the game isn't released. Not many people are going to play the Germans because the Germans, I think, are arguably worse right now. So... Just kind of a rough time for Germany and Berlin. But I think once it fully releases, we'll see probably some balance changes for Berlin. But I think we're going to kind of buff the Germans up a little bit. And maybe it's just that not many people want to play the Germans. And so we're not seeing a lot of German gameplay and a lot of good players on the Germans. There are a million Russians right there. Like actually just like 30. Oh my, oh my God, Quadro, you're an idiot. God damn it. I threw that directly into that wall. I think this car 98, I think the only thing that's different is it fires a little bit slower. They're on the objective, apparently. There we go. Let's just get a nade down there. Got him. Cleared him off. Got that guy. Oh, God. There's so many coming down. Oh, my God. Look at all these guys leaning. Those are all players. Oh, I just can't hit this guy. I'm getting bullet punched out the ass, dude. Fuck. Where'd this... Oh, no, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Put me out. All right, we're good. Okay. Just put ourselves out and then just immediately... Oh, crap. I got him. Got that guy. Uh oh Wiggle, 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 wiggle. 
bag. Easy. First try. No! The artillery! Oh my god, it's the ranging shots. Dude. I'm just gonna bandage. I'm probably gonna die here, but it's kind of okay. Yeah, it's one. Alright, whatever. I don't really think doing a tank matters at this point. This map just doesn't really work well for tanks. That's one thing you guys gotta keep in mind. Uh, that kind of goes with my recommendation there for the tank is that, you know, one of the problems with it is that these maps, a lot of these maps are not just, they're just not that good for tanks. You know what I mean? Oh, man, that was my really high level MP3008. Is that how you would say that? Just like 3008? Or is it like the MP3008 or something like that? Probably just 3008, I would guess. Looks like they got a rally point. That is unfortunate. We already have a tank outside. Yeah, it's just not worth it. These objectives are just rough as hell to hold. I wonder what the numbers are for, for Berlin. They're probably upwards of like 50 plus percent. Probably like 55, 60 even in favor of the Russians. I don't think it'd be much higher than that. I think there's definitely times where the Germans can hold. But it's pretty few and far between. I don't know. The devs, I'm sure, have numbers for it. But overall, Panther seemed pretty good. And the Panther A is a solid tank, too. It's different than the Panther G. It's got a little bit um, faster, faster turret rotation, which is a huge deal. And then the other really important thing about it is um, it does have less armor than the Panther G. So you got to keep that in mind as well. So now you can see if I just hit R here to reload, it's going to reload the full magazine, which I don't like that. I wish it just like moved the uh, the bolt over or whatever. You know, move the slide over so the other magazine is loaded. There we go. Got that guy finally. I want all this cover gone. So you'll see if I fire the rest of my bullets here, it'll stop firing. If I'm holding left click right now and then I let go of left click and then it changes the magazine over which i wish it just automatically did that i wish i didn't have to press the like I, I wish i didn't have to like stop firing i think it's kind of annoying to have to like stop firing to be able to do that kind of a little quality of life thing that i would really prefer to get i am run out of ammo here it is nice though one of the cool things with this gun is that if you request ammo here let me use up the rest of my ammo oh don't die Never mind. I'm, he's going to die if I leave him out here. Go, go, go. No, I tripped off. No, come on, man. Use the gun. God, dude, it like jumped on and then jumped off. Damn it. Sometimes that can be so inconsistent. I thought at first that maybe, maybe it got shot. Maybe that's what it was. Someone's got a tank outside. Maybe we jump in the Panther and take him down. They seem to have a lot of guys running around outside, so maybe it is worth it. Drop our rally point back here, though. Got to get the rally points for the team. Oh, hold, boys, hold! I'm getting the rally. Let's just send my. I'm gonna send my troops in. So they're gonna go in, and then I can maybe switch to one of them. Okay, no, we're just we're holding. We're good. There we go. So we got the rally. I hear a DP firing. Shit! Needed that kill there. That is a PPD there. Brutal. Brutal stuff, dude. The PPD, the PPSH, the PPK, whatever that other gun is. Is that going to kill me? Oh, no. Get away. All right, we're good. Although it blew up our cover, which means I'm now going to die. There we go. Um, Do we go with the Panther outside? I haven't seen very many deaths outside, so I think not. Try to respawn on this rally maybe the active battle nearby means people are dying around the rally point but we'll just spawn in the back and hopefully get up there quickly we need to go on the objective and then flank out so we can get me oh my god okay i'll take your dp 27 that's pretty good pretty excited for the dp um had no ammo on it uh oh oh it's just not working out we gotta get on the objective too just gonna throw the molly. Oh god. There's still more. One more on the point. Oh, there he is on the right. Oh, where's he at? Oh, he's on the point. Oh my god, he's sitting in the corner. 
Okay, at least we got the rally point back. And I did a lot of damage too. But I have this available. I probably should have played as them. No, I don't think they were available actually. Oh my god, they have this locked down with the DP. And nobody's like sniping. I guess they're all bots. It makes sense. All right. Well, anyway, guys, I just wanted to check that out. Check out the Panther. Get a video out for you guys. We got ton of XP there. My God. All right. So in that short time, we were in the Panther. We got a score of 2235, which gave us about 1400 XP um, with the premium account doubled that. So we went ahead and got 2918 total, which is a cubic shitload of XP, which is fantastic. So we got a nice 3K xp just for playing that tank for like what couple minutes and we didn't even do that good we got a couple tank kills we got a decent amount of normal kills but damn that's a lot of xp we didn't even win if we would have won the game we would have gotten even more xp so solid amount of xp definitely recommend that if you're trying to level up you can see i got just tons of xp right here um and again i wasn't even in that tank for very long so great stuff um, that was a good game, guys. So I, I think all in all, I would say I'd recommend the Panther A as a tank to pick up. It is very expensive. So I, I would say that that is the biggest caveat is that it is just ridiculously expensive. I believe it's like 30 bucks, 30 plus dollars. Um, I don't think I can actually look at it now. Um, but you can also pick up the LaBelle squad. The LaBelle squad is also kind of interesting. Um, it's a good, you know, bolt action rifle. But that's it, guys. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, as always, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I do appreciate it. Come check me out at twitch.tv slash heyquadro. We will be live again in a couple weeks here, guys. I am going on vacation. Um, I won't be back until late June, um, so don't expect too much activity. I will be active in Discord talking with you guys, so make sure you guys join Discord. You can find the link for that down in the description below. I'll have a couple videos coming out, um, but I will see you guys later. Take it easy and have a good one.